Hello everyone, welcome to Success Education. Today we'll be doing the workbook solution for English for Standard 8, Chapter Number 5, that is the Tiger's Claw. Before that, if you have not subscribed my channel till now, please do subscribe it for more videos. So we'll be starting with the MCQs. First one, which was a muddled moment for the writer? It's option number B. When a tiger was pushing himself in the room. Second. I understood the fertilizer company would have to manage without my lectures from the following day. Why does the writer say so? It's option number C. The writer felt for sure that the tiger would kill him. Third, what was the tiger startled by? It is option number D. The clattering noise of furniture. Fourth, what uh, daring act did the writer do to get rid of the tiger? It's option number C. He cut off three of the claws of the tiger's paw with a knife. Fifth one. The narrator could see I hear dash of the tiger clearly against the starlit sky. It's option number D. All the three. Sixth. A solid block was formed by its option number C, the chair, table and stool. Seventh, the most hideous sound for the narrator was its option number A, the tiger scratching the floor. Eighth, we generally see circus men managing wild animals with merely its option number D, chair. Ninth, one thing was common between the narrator and the tiger, pick in out, it's option number C, both were bloodthirsty. Tenth, when the tiger espied a gap in the furniture, he, it's option number D, thrust his paw in. Eleventh, the tiger overcame his fear of chair in one of the following ways, it's option number C, he patted the chair and found it inoffensive. Twelfth, when the tiger perched himself on the table, he tried to, it's option number A, strike the narrator with his paw. Thirteenth, with the smell of the tiger, the writer, it's option number A, was sick. Fourteenth, the narrator held up one of the following as a shield, it is option number B, chair. Fifteenth, after the tiger suddenly crouched down, he, it's option number C, scratched the floor with his claws. Now, question number two, read the following text carefully and answer the questions given below them. First one, what did the writer see against the starlit sky? Against the starlit sky, the writer saw a tiger wagging his tail, growling and his terrible eyes gleaming through the dark. Second, what made the tiger stand hesitating? The tiger was startled by the noise of the chair, so he stood hesitating. Third, what is referred to as the tiger's dinner? The writer himself was supposed to fall prey to the tiger, so the writer himself is referred to as the tiger's dinner. Now, second paragraph question answers. First one, what happened when the uh, writer dragged the table down? When the writer dragged the table down, a lot of things fell off it, a table lamp, a long knife and pins. Second, what seemed to shake up the little station house? The rumbling noise in the throat of the tiger seemed to shake up the little station house. Third, whom did the writer pity? Why? The writer pitied his own wife because if the writer died, his wife would lose her husband. Now, third paragraph question answers. First one, what made the tiger fall back? The writer flourished the chair towards the tiger, so the tiger hesitated and fell back a step or two. Second, he is sharpening them for me. What does the writer mean by these words? The tiger scratched the floor with his claws. This sight made the writer think that the tiger was sharpening his claws to kill the writer. Third, what made the writer sick? It was a very small room and owing to the presence of the tiger, the entire room had acquired the smell of a zoo. This made the writer sick. Now, uh, fourth paragraph question answers. First one, sprang up means, it's option B, jumped up. Second, what compliments did the writer give to the railways? 
द राइटर गेव दी कॉम्प्लीमेंट्स टू दी रेलवेज बाई सेंग दैट रेलवेज हैव अ लॉट ऑफ फोरसाइट एंड दे चोज दी हैवीएसट टिम्बर फॉर देयर फर्नीचर थर्ड वट डिड द राइटर डू टू सेव हिमसेल्फ द राइटर पैरीड विद अ चेयर एंड स्टूल वेन द टाइगर ट्राइड टू स्ट्राइक हिम डाउन Now question number थ्री uh, that is answer the following questions in uh, two or three sentences each. First one, describe the tiger as was seen by the writer when he opened his eyes. When the writer opened his eyes, he was startled to see at the door a tiger pushing himself in. The writer felt it like a dream continuing. He clearly saw the tiger against the starlit sky tail wagging growling and his terrible eyes gleaming Second what recollections did the writer get when he was trapped in a small room with a fierce tiger inside When the writer was trapped in a small room with a fierce tiger inside he recollected to have seen a circus in that circus the circus man managed a whole menagerie with just a chair he thanks god for such uh, recollections as they could save him at cricket uh, critical moments third when did the writer feel that his end was nearing the writer had made a stockit for him but the tiger was in no mood to let him go he advanced a step or two He made a sort of rumbling noise in his throat the sound seemed to shake up the station house then the writer felt that his end was nearing fourth uh, what did the tiger do when he could not manage to get hold of the uh, writer hidden under the table when the tiger could not manage to get hold of the writer hidden behind the table it sprang up on the table perched on it and hung down his paws he tried to strike the writer down but the writer tried to defend himself with a chair and stool fifth one describe the last scene when ultimately the writer defeated the tiger when the tiger espied a gap in the stockade he thrust his paw into the into to scoop portions out of the writer the writer felt very indignant He found a long knife lying nearby. He picked it up and drove into the tiger's paw. The tiger was mad with pain, but once more he tried to thrust his paw in. The writer managed to cut off three claws from the tiger's paw. Thus the tiger was defeated at last. Now question number 4 match the following. First one, tiger's dinner. It's option number C, writer. Second, clattering noise it's option number g furniture third wedge it's option number f table fourth shield it's option number a chair fifth hideous sound it's option number b scratching claws and sixth a small room it's option number d shack now question number 5 true or false first one The writer felt like a dream when he saw the tiger for the first time it is true second the writer knew it well that the tiger got a little frightened by the clattering noise of furniture it is true third the writer climbed up the table to save himself from the tiger it is false fourth the writer pitied the landlady of that house it is false fifth the tiger created a third by stamping his foot it is false sixth The writer felt that the tiger was scratching the floor for sharpening his claws to kill him it is true seventh the writer used a stool like a shield and flourished it it is false eighth the hideous sound of the tiger's claws made him sick it is true ninth when the tiger jumped on to the table the writer felt that the table would be reduced to matchwood it is true and the writer cut out three claws of the tiger with a knife it is true now we will see word power question number one is give the antonyms of the following words and use them in the sentences of your own and your antonyms means the opposites of the words okay first one starlit sky the answer is moonless sky 
Even in the moonless sky, we see stars shining brightly. Second, following preceding, it happened during the preceding year. Third one, evidently secretly, the project was carried out secretly. Fourth, sharp, blunt, you cannot punch a hole with a blunt tool. Fifth, vicious, virtuous, all men are never virtuous. Now question number two, complete the following text using the opposites of the words given in the brackets. So you can see the answers, happy, freely, open, thick, beautiful, happy, lot of, clean and fails. Now question number 3, replace the underlined words with the words given in the brackets. First one, I was surprised suddenly by the hissing sound in my bedroom. Second, God gives us such recollections with a view to save us at critical moments. Third, evidently he didn't like his meal to be so completely disappeared. Fourth, he tried to strike me down but I defended with a chair and stool. Fifth, the tiger would have bitten meat out of me for his use. Six, all the applications were sorted out carefully and the eligible candidates were shortlisted. Now we will see grammar part. First one is rewrite as directed. First one uh, we need to use as soon as. So the answer is as soon as I opened my eyes, I saw at the door a tiger pushing himself in. In the second one, you need to change the voice. So the answer is against the starlit sky, the thing was clearly seen by me. In the third one, you need to change the degree. So the answer is wild animals are not as afraid of being as they are of pieces of furniture. In the fourth one, you need to turn into affirmative. So the answer is circus man manage a whole managerie with just a chair in the fifth one you need to use so that so the answer is god gives us such recollections so that he can save us at critical moments in the sixth one you need to remove with so the answer is i sat keeping my back to the corner in the seventh one you need to change the voice so the answer is i was made sick by Eight. In the eighth one again you need to change the voice. So the answer is they are being sharpened for me by him. Ninth one you need to turn into negative. So the answer will be the tiger did not stop scratching the floor. Tenth one you need to change the degree. So the answer is no other sound was as hideous as it you could think of. Now we will see reading comprehension question answers. First one, what did the ancient Egyptians use honey for? The ancient Egyptians used honey as an embalming material for the mummies. Second, how was honey used in India in olden times? Honey was used to preserve fruits and to make cakes and other food in India in olden times. Third. Which religious books are mentioned in the passage? The religious books mentioned in the passage are Bible and Quran. Fourth, why is honey used to heal wounds and cuts? Honey is used to heal wounds and cuts because it has antiseptic properties. Now we will see writing part. Question number one is read the following telephonic conversation and prepare a message in about 30 words for your cousin. So the message is, Udgam, your English teacher called when you had gone for your music class. He wanted to convey the message that he had pain in his throat, so he won't be able to teach you for two days at home. Now question number two, you are in charge of cleanliness committee of your school. Students in your school bring in food packets and other eatables. They litter the classrooms, toilets, corridor and playground with the wrappers etc. Write a notice to ban such things in your school. So we will write notice then the name of the school and the heading that is keep the school clean. And now we will start with the notice. Students are being observed littering the school campus with torn pages, wrappers and leftovers of eatables. 
All the students are appealed to keep the school campus clean. The school authorities have decided to take strict actions against the defaulters. This new directive is in force with immediate effect. In charge cleanliness committee. In charge cleanliness committee is means uh, uh, written by in charge of cleanliness committee. Okay. Now question number three. Write a paragraph in about hundred words on the tiger, our national animal. So the paragraph is: the tiger is a wild animal belonging to the feline family. In terms of size, the tiger is the largest of all animals belonging to the feline family. Its scientific name is Panthera tigris. This is a very dangerous animal because it is more aggressive than a lion. The body shape of a tiger is much like that of other animals. Their claws and teeth are very sharp, making it very easy to hunt. Tigers are carnivores and eat forest animals such as deer, goats, cows and water buffaloes. Tigers are mostly tricolored with black strips across all three colors. These three colors are orange, white and gold. There are 9 species of tiger in the world of which the Royal Bengal tiger has the largest population. Now question number 4. That is study the following picture and write a paragraph in about 100 words. So you can see the picture and the paragraph is. The picture above is basically about animal labor and animal abuse. One of the ways non-human animals are exploited is to be used as workers. In the above picture, animals are used to carry loads in a circus and even beaten by few people. Some people may think that animals enjoy carrying out these tasks and that they benefit from being used in these ways. But this supposition does not hold right because it causes physical pain, stress and unhappiness. Animals are not born to be abused. Now we will see the additional activity that is uh, according to the pie chart you need to write about 8 sentences for this pie chart. Okay. So the paragraph is from the above information we can understand the viewing habits of people watching PALS serials that comes on after 7 a new TV channel according to their age groups. The survey was conducted on 1500 viewers of the serial. Out of them, the most viewers are from the age group of 21 to 25 and the least viewers are from the age group of 40 plus. Viewers of age groups below 20, 26 to 30, 31 to 35 and 36 to 40 are 315, 200, 123 and 75 respectively. And here we come to the end of chapter number 5 that is the tiger's claw. I hope you have understood the complete chapter. If you have any doubts, you can write in the comment section. I'll surely try to answer all the questions. Thank you for watching my video and do subscribe my channel for more updates. Thank you.